This is what we Republicans need to do a better job of, is explaining why we stand for a healthcare system focused on the individual and focused on the doctor and the doctor-patient relationship and not national health care. Why we as Republicans stand for an energy policy that makes us less dependent on foreign oil and relies on market-based solutions, not, not the hand of big government. Why we as Republicans stand for an education system that focuses on kids and learning and teachers and not on bureaucracy. What we as Republicans stand for, as I said earlier, spending restraint, lower taxes, more responsive government. Uh, these are all issues that people care about. We not only have an opportunity as Republicans to get back on our feet and to bring the party together after a, a nominee is chosen, uh, but also it is incredibly important that we do it because all those issues I talked about really are issues that will affect the future of this county, of this great state, and of our nation. Think about it. If we do elect a Democrat president, and there is a Democrat Congress in place, as there is now, uh, you will not see the vetoes and threatened vetoes of these spending bills. You will see spending levels that are higher than we have seen in our nation's history as a percent of our economy. In terms of actual numbers, year to year, you'll see spending go up. You'll see taxes go up. Uh, I believe you will see, therefore, a burden on the economy that's going to result in less prosperity for us and for future generations. Uh, you will see a different approach in terms of national security. Uh, less of a focus, less of an emphasis, less funding for the national security functions. And you just look at the budgets, again, that the Democrats are working on in the US Congress. This is an incredibly important time. 